waiting for this moment. That's right, because I've not had barber now for a couple of days. Although it did arrive yesterday, but I only got a chance to open one thing um, because I kind of got a little bit sidetracked by the Hubble Eyes doll. So, there's a lot of barber nail to go through today, and here it comes! I hope you're excited, because I am! Oh yeah! Here it comes! And... Boom! First, the barber nail package! And... Boom! Ooh, another package, but that's something to do with barber nail! And... Boom! A lovely pink package! That's right! Boom! This one with a customs form attached! Oh yeah! Boom! Not in a box, not really barber nail, but kind of barber nail, so we'll add it to the pile! Oh yeah! And... Boom! Ooh, this is quite a big one, I like that a lot! Oh, the double-sided one, but I need to cover the address, so I'm going to double boom it. Boom, boom! That's right, we got two. Oh, and it doesn't stop there. I've got an open one. Boom! Another box. Can you still see it going? And the last boom. Oh, here it comes. Boom! So I've got a lot to unpack. I'm going to cut to the have a look at the product scene. Yay! So, the reason I have so much barbe and doll mail today is that yesterday's only one of it got opened because I just had such a busy day. And probably unlike normal people, when the post arrives, I can't just open it. Everything has to be just right. So that means all the other things that need doing have to be done and in place before I can open the box and see what's inside. So, I've got a lot of exciting stuff to show you. I'm going to start with a boom! Mini Mister, first of all. Now, he's not technically Bob A. Mail, but a look at what's on his feet. Bum, 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 bum. That is right, he's got some new shoes on. Oh my day, check these out. How incredible are they? Can you see, focus, focus, don't really know where to focus. Can you see the incredible detail on these lace-up sneakers? Oh yes, they are very converse. They are real laces. They're like a rubbery kind of material, so they're actually really easy to get on. A bit more difficult to lace up at the top. Um, I don't know if anybody else has the same problem, but it's very difficult tying things when you can't really feel your fingers properly for a start anyway. But really impressed with these. They were actually shoes that Colleen bought. Um, they were 5 dollars off eBay. They've come from China, but they are incredible. I actually think we should order more of those for more dolls because the detail is immense. Excellent quality, super cool shoes, very happy and cheap as chips. Oh yeah, so that's the first bar we'll send you time. <laughs> the first bar they mail, okay? Oh boy! The next item of Bob A. Mill, along the same kind of lines as maybe a bit more masculine, is a boom! And this! Palm Hero! So, Colleen has started to buy a few of these. I think it's, um, the company is abbreviated to Did Co. Uh, it does stand for something, but I'd be lying to say I know what it is, so let's just imagine it stands for Dynamic Industry Diddy Men. I have no idea. Um, but yeah, he ordered this uh, thinking it was 1-6 scale, but when it arrived, it was actually clearly not. It's from Saving Private Ryan, and it is Matt Damon. These figures are absolutely incredible, so if any of you have partners that you want to kind of encourage into collecting, and maybe they're not into Barbe, I would highly recommend looking at some of these because they're incredible. First of all, the box itself, super thick quality box. It's got a magnetic lid, which when you turn it around, boom! It's your own little diorama backdrop! How incredible is that? So you get that for a start, this little backdrop. Check it out. And then it has this lift up sleeve here. Oh yes, yeah, tells you how to take the heads on and off. Lovely foam lining and ribbon. Oh yes, yeah, so we lift the little lid off and it reveals the teeny tiny Matt Damon man with all of his accessories. I mean, they are just insane. The detail on the doll and it's articulated. It's just immense. And sometimes with these, you get a second layer. Now I don't know if there is one with this or not. Try and we'll see. Oh yes, it's got a second layer. Wait till you see this. More teeny tiny accessories. Look at his little bag. So Colleen said I could keep this, which is very nice of him, because I'm sure it will come in handy. So that was another Bob A. Mail, not Bob A. Mail item that arrived for me. Oh yes! Right, next item I didn't buy. Colleen seemed to think that I would like one of these, because I did have one on watch on eBay. I'm just trying to find which one I have on watch. I have one of these on. Are you ready? Boom! It's a teeny tiny person, like a little human. How cute is she? Ha! I just thought she had the cutest little face. I think they are Mattel, right? 2009. Um, I don't know, maybe somebody can tell me the other one. I'm just trying to see if it's in on it, if she's Mattel or not. No, it doesn't actually say Mattel. T-Y-Ink? Are they the people that make the teddies? Um, but anyway, she's got a super cute face, and I thought, oh, she's really sweet, have one on watch. Then what arrives in the post today? Wait till you see what arrives in the post. Let's just pop that down so I can stand there. She arrives, obviously. And then, as if she wasn't enough, she arrives. Yep. Oh my days, a little one there. Oh, sorry, let's just line down. Another one. And then, another one. That's right. And then, another one. Yep, that's right. Doesn't stop there, because then, there's another one. Yep. And another one! Oh my days, doesn't stop there! A boom! Last little girl! How adorable is she? They're just so sweet! So I need to know, um, obviously some of them, there's not very much point washing the clothes because I think they've kind of had it. Can you buy clothes? Oh, little pump one as well, what the hell, look at that! Uh, can you buy clothes for these dolls? Does anybody know what they actually are, please? Um, and with them came these three teeny tiny puppy dogs! Look, they're not wonky! Oh, cat! So I've got a kitten and two puppies. Oh, that was a bow! 
that's so cute. Looks like he's running for candidate. <laughs> so, a little group of dollies, which are very cute, need some new outfits. Can anybody suggest or tell me what they are? Are they Mattel or not? Not articulated, but I want them to be new, and they're very cute. Now, the next item is a very special one. It's from a lady who bought a number of items from before, and she's called Rachel Crafts. She is a, a multi crafter, and she makes the most amazing clothing for Barbet and other size dolls, and has made me something based on a very dodgy drawing I sent to her. And it is, are you ready for this? Boom! It is my very own IKEA shelving unit! How incredible is that? And it's not just incredible because it's IKEA shelving, it's also. Oh, yes! It's, what's the word? It's interchangeable! Yes, that's the word I was looking for. It's interchangeable. So these little things can be taken out and moved around and put basically wherever you want them based on what's going on the shelves. So how nice is that of her? I mean, I sent her the worst dimensions and drawing ever and she's managed to work out what I meant. Perfect size, I think, for the living room or even, it could even be like some dressing room for shoes and handbags. Oh my days. Not only did she send that, she sent me these. Boom! Look at these storage cubes! How amazing are they? I love it because you can basically put them in any kind of format. I'm losing words this evening uh, that you want, so you can have them any kind of setup. That is just incredible. I love these. Absolutely love them. So thank you very much for those, Rach. I am very happy. And she's even sent me, I don't know if this is because of my blue roll lingerie, a teeny tiny toilet roll. Oh my days, how cute is that? Love it. So pop that there, my teeny tiny little roll for my blue roll lingerie, which I thought was very nice. And finally, but by no means least, check out my plant! She's made me a teeny tiny house plant with a little gravel inside it as well, which is just adorable. So I shall put that there. Thank you very much. Ooh, very excited by that. Right, the next item is a doll item. It's from a seller again, I bought from before. I think she's called Bella Boo Blythe. And oh my days, these are incredible. Are you ready for this? A boom! It's a package of goodies. Oh yeah? Now I bought from before a Blythe outfit, but it was before I had a Blythe doll, and I used it on Barbe and some of the Integrity dolls, and it fit perfectly. So I'm very excited with this one because it looks so adorable. And I have to say, she really doesn't charge a massive amount for this whole outfit. And I also used the page to put it like time as a rug. <laughs> so it was so cool. So here we go. Oh my days, these are amazing. First thing, bubble hat. How amazing is that? Oh, I love that. Multicolored bubble hat, that's so cute. And the softest wool ever. A teeny tiny wrap cardigan. Look at the little button on it. That is adorable. So, so cute. Pet matching socks. <laughs> my days. And then the cutest little skirt ever. Oh, oh wow, look. Can you see? It's got these tiny little skeletons dancing on it. Love that a lot. And shoes I can now use because I've got a blind. Teeny tiny sneakers. So thank you so much for that outfit. Bella Boo Belive. And I got another package. Boom, can you see it? Oh, that is only Harry Potter. Wow. I'm so excited by this one. Amazing packaging again. Another lovely Etsy seller. Also on Instagram. That's Bella Boo Live. Let's have a look on this one. So this one has got black sneakers. Oh, look at those. I mean, they're just adorable, aren't they? Look. How cute are they? Puppets, puppets. They are so cute. Uh, little skirt with a Harry Potter logo on it there. That is very cute. And this is my favourite. Look at that jumper. Oh my day. And it's not like just any kind of wool. This is the most luxurious, silky wool ever that she's used on this. Um, Harry Potter logo. Little button on the back. It's adorable. I think that'll fit Barbet as well, if I'm honest. That is amazing. And then some cool stripy socks. Love those. And a little Harry Potter necklace. Oh yes. So love those a lot. Really reasonably priced. Highly recommend that seller if you're into dolls of any kind, to be honest, because these will fit more than just blind. That is gorgeous. So thank you very much for those. They're amazing. Right, next up is a package from the super lovely Jo. And her business, actually a few packages, look at these. Her business is called Dolly's Dolls. Is it 246 or is it 245? I think it's 246. I will put a link below afterwards anyway. Um, ordered some more dolls off her. Again, it's not always me. Sometimes somebody else likes them and says, get them, get them, just get them. So I did. So I'm going to see who we ordered. Oh, it's a blonde girl. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah. What do we get in? What do we get in? Oh, and something with pink hair as well. Oh, yeah. Oh, my day. These are amazing. Oh, my day. She's gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at this cute little thing in the pocket. Little fairy. So this is the first girl. She is, oh my day, she's a blonde girl. Her dress is just coming down, so I just pull it up a bit. How cute is she? Look at those eyes. So again, these are the BJD dolls because they are ball jointed and you can articulate their arms and their legs and their feet and everything from the head as well. Uh, very, very cute, this little girl with the blonde hair. So she's the first one that we got. Let's pop you there if we can, next to the bookshelf. Uh, this girl, oh my days. This is actually the one that I did the poll on Instagram about saying, should I get her or not? Look at her face. Oh my days, I don't really need to focus focus because you can see those eyes. She is gorgeous in a little outfit as well. So she's super cute, really like her. I love her little outfit. She's very cute. This one I'm getting Beauty and the Beast kind of bell vibes. You are so sweet. Let me put you there. I don't remember ordering another doll though, to be honest. Um, I don't think I ordered these. I think, I think Joe's put these in because honestly I don't remember ordering more. No, definitely didn't. Oh my days. Joe, these are amazing. Oh my days. 
Oh, what's he saying? This little girl? Boom! Oh, that is a cute boom. Look at her little hat with her ears on. Oh, my days. Oh, I love her hair as well. I've not got anybody with grey hair yet. She's very cute. Look at her little outfit with the little jewels on it. How adorable is she? Oh, yes. Oh, I love her. Love her so much. She's so cute. You can stand on that side there, please. Oh, yes. Oh, there's another one. Who's the other one? Who's the other one? <gasps> boom! Oh, my days. Oh, she's so cute. Oh, they're all so cute. Look at her little outfit. Oh, my days. The little trouser, little pant thing, like pantaloons. Oh my days, she is adorable. How cute is she? Yes, love her a lot as well. Joe, thank you so much. I'm sure we only ordered two, so um, thank you for sending them. They're absolutely gorgeous. And it doesn't stop there, because there's something here. I've no idea what this is. And something here. So we go for the tag on, and it says, saw this and thought of you. Okay. Let's have a look what's in here. What's Joe sent? Oh my days. Oh my days, I think. Is it something gold there? What is it? Oh my days. <gasps> that is absolutely gorgeous. It's a Barbie hair accessory. That is beautiful. I am wearing that all day long. Doesn't stop. Unless it was meant for the Barbie, but I'm wearing it. And this one. Wow. Oh, I love that as well. That is gorgeous. Thank you so much, Joe. They are amazing, and I will be wearing those. Wow. I love those a lot. Thank you very much. And then let's see what this is. What is this? What is this? Oh, I think I know what this is. I think this is one of the little. Um, is it a pram? I always see Joe's little wife white babies in. Oh my days, this is so cute. <gasps> wow! Oh wow! Wait to do this. Oh my days. Check this out. It's a teeny tiny little pram. And it says a bebe on the back, which is very cute, in blue frill and netting. And this is the perfect size for those little bebes that I bought from Joe, the little wife white ones. And I think it will fit the normal Barbie ones in as well. Or we could put it in the playroom. Oh yes, yes, yes. It could actually be for these girls, so they can push that with a bebe in it along, yes, stop motion right there all day long. Thank you so much, Joe. Right, the next package of goodness is something from someone I've not bought from before. Um, I found them through an Instagram account called Bella Bella Doll, that a lot of you should know, and if you don't know, go follow, because it's like one of the accounts to follow in the doll collecting dollstagram. Um, and the site is called Energy Design. I saw this particular item on one of the Bella Bella dolls and I thought I need it. I need that so much. So, boom, here it is. Look at the cute packaging. This is absolutely adorable. It's not a UK based company, but it didn't take that long to get here. I just love the style of it and I cannot wait to put it on one of the girls. Check this out. So, it's a coat dress. It is absolutely gorgeous material. It's actually quite a thick cotton material. And look, there's a little popper there. And the little um, polka dot sort of line in there, which is very cute. I like that a lot. The idea is it is a dress, so it's not a coat, it's actually a dress, and when it's on, it looks stunning. The reason I like it is, it reminds me of William Morris print, which my dad used to absolutely love. So I love that, very happy with that. Very nicely packed, it's come all the way from, I'm assuming from Italy, if it's an Italian boutique for dolls. I suppose it could still be an Italian boutique and not in Italy. Um, but anyway, that's Anna G Design, and it's the most gorgeous dress. And she's sent with it, a boom, a teeny tiny gift. Look at the bag, little shoulder bag. And also a pair of gorgeous earrings that will match that dress. So thank you very much for that, Anna Design. Very happy with that dress. I'm going to be putting that on mini-me tomorrow. Oh yes, I'm thinking of my goodies. Now, a little box. I haven't opened it, but I saw the card and I smiled because I know who this is from. This is from Little Bit of Rainbow Co. And she sent a card and it's got a message and it says, Claire, Bobbe, Big Girl Gang, Little Girl Gang, Bobbe Family and Extended Family and Friends. How sweet is that? So she's put me a little card in it. Um, and I've had a few chats now with this super lovely lady through Instagram. She makes the most amazing items and you will see I bought the Emma Bridgewater teapot and cups and saucers from her and also Zach's rainbow cake. And I love her little car, so it's so cute. And it says, to Claire and the Dolly Collection. <laughs> Thank you, I am, I am trying out, I don't know what that says. I am trying out something, could say frames? No? I've included a prototype. Ooh, let me know what you think. I thought you could cut out the rainbow and put it in the picture frame. That way, Barbe will always have a little bit of rainbow in the Barbe house. Loving your vids. Can't wait to see the new stuff. Love cake and rainbows, Liz. Ah, that's so cute. That's so lovely. So, so lovely. Thank you very, very much. So, I had already kept the first card she sent me because I just really thought it was super cute. And she's saying she sent a frame in here. Um, and I did order some bits from her as well. So, let's have a look what is inside this package of dreams. I uh, apologise in advance because today's video is going to be very long, but there is some really cool stuff here. Ooh, ah. Right, these are very carefully packaged, as always. Be keeping that packaging. Now I ordered from her Alice in Wonderland uh, Mad Hatter's tea party range because I just thought it was adorable. The first item is, oh my days. Boom, it's a teeny tiny cake stand. It is just adorable. So it's like a gilt blue 
gorgeous cake stand. It is just beautiful and it is perfect size for Barbet for a table. Focus, focus, focus. Centerpiece. Love that a lot. That is super cute. And then to go with that, because I think everybody's had nearly all of the rainbow cake now, I ordered some. Are you ready for this? <coughs> Queen of Hearts Tots. Oh yes, look at that! Oh my days. Look at the detail on that. That is just incredible. Look at that. That looks good enough to eat. And obviously I got three. One each. Oh yes. So they will sit on my little cakes down there as my centerpiece for my next part eye. Love that a lot. So thank you so much. Trying to show you that without me pulling off. Super cute. And that is a little bit of Rainbow Co. And my card from her. Very, very cute. And lastly, this is her prototype frame. It's not. I stand corrected. There's also something else in here I ordered. Which I'm very excited about. Oh my day. Wait to see these. Oh, my dad would have absolutely loved these. Wow, it's only a teeny tiny leather bound book with gold clasp. Look at that, you can even see the pages. That is absolutely insane. Now, I don't know whether you knew this or not already, but my dad used to bind books and he was very much into leather and any kind of old books and he would have absolutely loved these. Didn't get just one, no, I got three. Look at the detail on these, wow. That, they are just incredible and I bought them purposely to go on this amazing bookshelf. Oh yes, look at that! Oh yes, oh I think I need more books now. Maybe this could be a library instead. Oh, the possibilities are endless. Wow, and this is a little frame. Oh wow, look at that! That reminds me of a bit of Friends. Oh yeah. Ooh, so, it obviously can be a picture frame and I can cut this out like she suggested, pop it inside the frame and put it on the wall. Very, very nice. Also, my suggestion would be, you could use this for a party, couldn't you? You know how people like hold them up in front of their faces and take a picture? Or is that just me? Yeah, focus, 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 focus. No, focus, no. Anyway, that is lovely. I love it. I'm definitely going to use it. The colour is perfect for the Barbet house, so I'm going to do what you suggested and put my little bit of rainbow in the living room. So thank you so much for all those goodies. A little bit of rainbow. Oh, huzzah. Okay, second to last Barbet mail is this. How pretty is that? I don't know what this is, so let's have a look and see. I think it's another Etsy mail. Ooh, what is it? Very cute. I love all these little stickers that people use on the packages. Very, very sweet. It's a really nice touch. Uh, but I genuinely have no idea what this is. It's very well packed. Ooh, how cute is that? Okay, so this is from Leah Sprague and she is made at home crafts. She's an artist and a blogger. Wow, it says, ooh, this is good. Hi Claire, thanks for your order. A special gift for you. I've got 10% off. Ooh, little giveaway here, it's just Blythe and me. Oh yes, also 10% off. Colin, you listening? Got 10% off. This seller was on Etsy. Oh yes, cannot wait to see what this is. Aren't you ready? So, teeny tiny organza bag, you know how I love those. And a teeny tiny tin. Ooh, this could be like a story, couldn't it? The teeny tiny organza bag reveals a teeny tiny tin. But what was in the teeny tiny tin? She asked. It said, Blythe and Me by Leah Sprague. Ooh, I hope you know the story. So she went to open the teeny tiny tin with an unscrew. <laughs> That's the noise it made. And it revealed... <gasps> Boom! Oh my! Oh my god! Oh my god! It's a teeny tiny apple! Oh my days, that is insane. Wow, that is insane. Oh my days, I need a load of these now. Right now, every single girl in this house and guy needs one of these. Wow, so the packaging for a start is insane. That teeny tiny tin is gorgeous. But wait till you see this. Oh my days, that is insane. Can I, I don't even know if I can focus enough to show you how incredible this is, but that is absolutely incredible. A little screen on it as well, and it says love incoming call. Oh, now as far as I'm aware, this is for a Blythe doll, but I wonder, who else it might fit? The only issue is it's got to be a doll that you can take the hands off because it doesn't undo. Um, so somebody that you can take the hands off, put that on the wrist. That is incredible. Wow, wow, wow. So Leah, this is absolutely insane. The packaging is immense. The product is incredible. I don't even think this was that expensive, but I now need loads of these because that's amazing. And we've got 10% off. Colin, you're listening. 10% off, we need more of those. So thank you very much. That is wonderful. I absolutely love that. And you need to go and visit Blythe and me on Etsy. Now for the last package, and it's a good one. It's from Boom Bush Baby. Now I've bought from Bush Baby before. They do sell a different scale of items. I think it's one at twelve scale. I could be wrong. I could need to be corrected. But I found that some of her items are suitable for one six scale if you use them in a slightly different way. Now this packaging, first of all, is immense. I do recall she had amazing packaging before. I mean, look at that. That is insane. And then it opens up into oh all kinds of goodies. Wait till you see what I've got in here. <clears throat> the first items I ordered were shoe wraps. And you will see why, because boom, boom, more Ikea stuff. Oh, yes. These are definitely going to be shoe storage for Barbet because I know they fit shoes in because that was a picture she put on her Instagram page. They are supposed to be for that size of a doll, really, as shelves. But like I say, you can utilise them in a different way. Super thick. Um, and how perfect do they look alongside this amazing unit? 
that Rachel's built for me, so I'm very happy with those. And then finally, again, look at this immense packaging. It's just insane. This here, let's have a look at this. Oh yes, how cute is that? Now again, it's a smaller scale, but I thought I could make it work for Barbe because I'm going to put it on the sideboard for things like pens. Oh yes, so that is super cute. And the last two bits, oh, because you know I love the good tray. <laughs> two teeny tiny storage trays, which I thought would be good for letters. As you did. Oh, oh yes, oh yes, on my shelving unit at the back there. Oh yes, oh, that's it. Oh, well, if I take one of the things out, yeah, but no, I want that on the sideboard. That was my intention with that. But these are so cute on here. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. So I've got some amazing purchases today from some wonderful sellers. I will link all of them below. I hope you enjoyed looking at my wares. Rach, thank you so, so much for making those IKEA shelves for me. I'm now trying to decide which room is worthy of them. Do I make a study? Do I make like a library? Do I leave it for ornaments? I'm just struggling to decide now because it's so amazing and so versatile. That was the word I was looking for before. I love it. Absolutely love it. So thank you very much. I will link all these sellers below. Yes, because everything is amazing. My little house plan. Super cute things from Bush Baby. My beautiful dolls from Dolly's Dolls and my extras. My teeny tiny little random orphans that are now coming to live at the Lombardi Way. Gonna need some bunk beds, I think. And my beautiful rainbow goodies. My lovely books there. My cake stand. My cakes. And I've just been totally spoiled as well because I've got some goodies for myself today as well. I can't wait to use those. Oh, and not forgetting my present. And lots of clothes. So thank you for watching. And until next time, bye. Please remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel and share it with all your friends. So until next time, stay barbaliciously bonkers. Keep an eye out on Facebook and Instagram for my daily updates and I'll see you soon. Bye!